What's going on everybody? Thanks so much for coming over to watch this video. I'm excited today guys. I just got Modern Warfare 2 guys. I've been up all night, alright, till 12.01 for the release of the new Call of Duty game guys. I'm hyped up. This game is so good. That I'm, I'm at that point right now where I'm not working all week. I'm not doing anything all week. I'm calling things off. I'm changing my calendar around. I'm pushing things for a couple of days. I need to enjoy this game. If you agree, guys, post your comments on the comment section. Modern Warfare 2 is the next, the new. And I have to do it, guys. I have to upgrade to the vault edition because I wanted the ghost operator. You got to have it. Do it right now if you have not upgraded or purchased the vault edition. You got to get ghost. That's the character that's basically throughout the gameplay comes up often. You got to play with this dude. I'm going to do a launch gameplay. Basically, what's new? What do we got? Right? What, 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 what's included with the game? So if you as hyped up as I am, please join me. Let's walk through what we got in the game. Let's hop in. I've been up all night long playing this thing back to back. And I'm ready to make this video my final launch video of the Modern Warfare 2. But like I always do, guys, in the coming weeks and months... There's going to be some games that I'll throw in my uh, video content on laptops or monitors or whatever other computer or product I'm using and testing. Definitely going to probably pop uh, Modern Warfare 2 on those videos. And I'll be sharing some campaign level like videos on the channel. With that said, please give this video a thumbs up, like it, share it, post comments on the comment section. And please, if you're not yet a subscriber, you're here for the first time, hit the subscribe button below this video because a lot more gaming content is coming up here at Hernandez Elite Gaming. Alright, I'm hyped up y'all. Let's go ahead and do a walkthrough real quick before we jump into our gameplay. So as we can see, we have an awesome uh, background here, this wallpaper look thing. Um, it, it takes the complete size of the screen. Uh, looks like probably later on down the line as they upgrade the game, they're gonna be adding other uh, game features here like Warzone or whatever uh, on here just by getting a feel of the screen here. Uh, but we have to choose the games we have, which is good to see. So let's click on that. And then, of course, here, they've definitely changed this interface also, guys, a bit. I don't know if later on they'll upgrade it or change it or whatever, if they keep it as is. But we can quickly see that as we scroll, we have our multiplayer tab, we have our campaign tab, and we also have our cooperative tab. So we do not see two or three different options as we used to see in the first game where we have campaign, multiplayer, etc. Now it seems to be all bundled nicely together in this one interface. Now we can quickly see that each of these options will give us a new wallpaper, a new backdrop. We can see that very interactive, very modern, very new. Right, which I like that because it quickly lets me know, oh wow, I am going to rescue somebody. Okay, third person. I can see myself playing and so on. As we go into the multiplayer levels, of course, we have several options here that they've added and I'm sure they're going to add more over time. We get the introduction of Invasion. We did that on the multiplayer um, open beta, the video that I created, and they now introduce Ground War, which you already know, this is going to be probably one of those Battlefield-like games um, with high uh, levels of people and also huge maps we expect to see here from 
driving vehicles to tanks. I mean, you're able to pretty much do everything. We also have a private match option and a benchmark option. Don't know really what those are, but I'll be testing those out in the coming weeks. And then, of course, you're able to test those out yourself. On the campaign side of things, guys, I do like the idea of starting a new game, also selecting the mission I want to replay. I remember back in the days when we used to play games, we could not go back unless we had to start over. Now I'm able to select the mission that I want to play again, which is a great thing. Another thing that I personally like as well is the introduction of cinematics where we're able to play those certain videos, right, that were introduced throughout the campaign levels. Love that. On the other side here, we have low profile, denied area, and defender. So there's some interesting thing happening here on the game mode side of things. Now, of course, we have prison uh, prisoner rescue as one of the featured options but it's not listed here on the multiplayer side other than up here which is interesting to see that uh, let's head over to operators here really quick now if you upgrade to the vault edition like i said you do get these characters here you get price you get uh farah you get ghost you get soap Right, so you do get several extra uh, operators that I think is great, plus other things that are included and added to the game from the standard edition to the vault edition. So can't wait to see how that plays out. On the weapons side of things, you already know, we kind of covered this a little bit last time, but we, we do have the introduction of vehicles, uh, kill strikes, um, and they somehow multiplayer loadout is locked. Uh, loadout edit is locked at level four. This is a new game. I'm only on level one right now, which makes total sense because you want to build on your weapons, right? You know how you, as you win, as you score, you get more and more and more uh, points and you get perks. And that's going to be weapons and things like that. Let's say Nothing like going in the game right now. Let's go ahead and do ground war. All right, let's do this. Ground war, baby. Come on, where are y'all? All right, approaching. Don't see nobody. All right, I see, I see. Let's go ahead and head over there to the uh, enemy side. They're right inside there. Enemy spotted. Enemy spotted, careful. Behind the scenes, got a goddamn grenade. Oh, hell no. Get him from the roof. Let's go. I'm gonna kill him from the roof. I swear to you. Look at him. Look at him. Got him. Go ahead and choose this one here. This is definitely 
new. I believe Warzone did, but not this one. Let me see if I can get lucky with this guy. That, my boy got me. Let's do a third person uh, shoot or two, perhaps. Let's just do one and see uh, how, how Ghost uh, Operator looks and how is the gameplay. So what do you think so far, guys? You know, post your comments, ask your questions, share the video, like it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, guys. I'm going to be releasing uh, more gameplay videos on Modern Warfare 2. Okay, this is different. Okay, what the hell's going on here? <laughs> this, this is different. Okay. I like this. It's a little different, third person. Wow, so realistic, guys. And this level is pretty interesting. Look, 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 look. Enemy nearby. Box, right, let's get real. different too. I'm on level three, baby. Level three. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go ahead and do, uh, really quickly, let's kind of run through some of the uh, options here. So on the top right here, guys, this is where you'll go for all the different channels you'll have, right? Um, and then here you go into basically the menu where you can see the progress, your social achievements, etc. Um, let me go ahead and cancel this here. Okay. And then you go back to the main menu here, right? And then you have all the choices uh, on here. Um, let me go ahead and look at uh, what do we got here? Mission select. Okay. Let's see. Proceed. Let's see what that does, if it's going to open, ah, oh. so it's going to open a single player like application within the game, because it, it came out and now it's going back in, interesting, okay, and I bet you we're going to expect to see that added to the interface where we sell games, multiplayer, single player, etc. Where you know, hey, if that's what I want to do, I go into that. I don't want to do so through the multiplayer option. Mm, there we are. And this is where I left off my uh, campaign early access video, guys. I'm going to be releasing more videos. And what I normally do is... I'll create a video of me playing that one campaign where I beat up the level from beginning to end and go that way. Um, we're not going to do a campaign gameplay right now. Uh, we're just kind of giving a feel for what's throughout the game, right? Go ahead and uh, head out of here. 
So I can definitely choose my mission, which is cool. Let's go back in one more time and we'll wrap this up. Come on now. There you go. So I believe it's going to bring up the multiplayer application because that's what we had and we did not choose a campaign level. So let's see if it does that. Come on now. Very, very good. Very, very good. Let's go ahead and check out this prisoner rescue and see what this is and if if it's any different. I know we tested out in the open beta the invasion game mode. Um, interesting to see what this is. So the defend and rescue. I wonder, you know, keep the prisoners from being taken. Okay. So I have to defend the prisoners. Gotta defend them. Oh, interesting. Got me. Oh, so I can spawn through others, which is cool. That's an interesting way to look at um, expecting a player. It's kind of cool. We'll go ahead and wrap it up right here. We got a lot more gameplay coming up, um, a lot more gaming videos coming up on many, many things like products that I'm using. For example, I got myself the Alienware S5000 gaming chair. I'm going to be making videos on that. Also, we got some good games uh, that I'm going to be making gameplay on Far Cry 6, Modern Warfare 2. Battlefield 2042, the list goes on. So stay tuned on that. Let me go ahead and uh, get out of here really quick. And also, too, and lastly, guys, there's going to be other gaming products that I'm going to be uh, putting on the channel, like custom building a new desktop. It's been a minute that I've done that. Uh, probably do like one or two low budget, high budget, premium, standard, etc. Um, also, too, um, gaming on a monitor, one of the newest, one of the hottest, and a laptop or a desktop. So those types of gaming videos are coming up. And also too, which I've been wanting to do, is the new PS5 uh, and the new Xbox. Have not tested those out. And so looking forward to those sort of options and many, many other game-like videos on other gaming options that you can play like on your phone, on your tablet, you guessed it. So please subscribe to the channel for those upcoming videos. Give this video a thumbs up, like it, share it, and I want to hear from you about 
Modern Warfare 2. What do you think about the game? Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time.